The Earth is called the water planet because it has approximately 14,108 cubic kilometers of water. However, lakes are some of the best sources of fresh water on the Earth's surface. To this end, experts promote the conservation of these water bodies. Viva Noguchi has more. 97.5% of the Earth's water exists in the sea and nearly all of the remaining fresh water is locked up in the Antarctic or Arctic ice caps or as groundwater. That leaves us with lakes as the best available fresh water source on the planet. Take for instance this lake. This is Lake Moses and lakes like this absorb water during flooding and then they release the same water during droughts. So we take a trip through a thick forest to this other impressive water body. We now have Lake Nora which is named after my mother and Lake Moses which is named after my dad and during the rainy season the two lakes come together. So I feel absolutely fantastic about that. Lakes are also valued for tourism. However, these respondents say Nigeria has not taken advantage of its potential when it comes to tourism. Uh, many Nigerians, I can tell you, do not know a place like this exists. And my fear is that when they find out, they'll be looking at how to turn this place into an estate. We are some of the friendliest, warmest people you'll ever meet anywhere in the world. So we need to capitalize on that and also our diversity and also our you know, cultural activities, not to mention the wonderful locations we have. Lakes are also valued for recreation, for example, kayaking. Kayaking is um, it's a sport, a water sport that involves the use of a kayak and a paddle. It's more like canoeing, but this is not canoe, this is, this is kayak. So when you kayak a lot, it helps with your heart rate. So if, for example, you have troubles breathing, there was a time, for example, where I had troubles breathing, I had to do this. So you see, lakes are more than just a simple body of water. There are important ecosystems that, when respected and cared for, can sustain a healthy balance of aquatic life, provide us with much enjoyment, and help support our socio-economic needs. Viviana Guche for STV News.